Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're making a SIG World video and as you can see, we've got 11 SIG Sauer handguns here and we're going to showcase them all. SIG World, I've done it with others, now it's time for SIG. I've never had 11 at one time, but we do today. We're at the range, we're gonna have some fun and we're gonna review some guns. Let's start SIG World out with a P226, one of the most popular guns, if not the most popular gun from Sig Sauer, a very long standing gun, and it's a beauty. 15 round mags and nine millimeter, 4.4 inch barrel. This one has G10 grips, Sig Light night sights, aluminum frame, and a rail. Just an amazing handgun. It's often a duty gun, competition, you name it. The P226 fits the bill. Man, never gets old shooting a P226. We're gonna follow that up with another P226. This time, it's a single action Legion. It has many different frame cuts, a uh, little undercut in the trigger guard. You can see that it's also like a PVD coated gray. It's got a beautiful look to it. A little more of a rubber grip. Same 15 round magazine. It does have an ambidextrous thumb safety there. Fiber optic front sight, same. 4.4 inch barrel, single action, flat face trigger, and it's a sweetheart. My glasses are fogging up a bit. Let's see how I do. All right, uh, the gun performs better than I did just now, but it's a little moist out here. Here we have a SIG P229 in 40 Smith & Wesson. Now this was created after the P226 in the early 90s and made specifically for 40 Smith & Wesson. That's what this is. It has a 12-round magazine. This one has an extension, so it's a 14-round mag. I don't have that loaded up. But the same deal, just about a 4-inch barrel, SIG light night sights, aluminum frame, clearly a rail because it has a TLR1 on there. But a, a very nice shooting handgun. It's all SIG Sauer. Still a fan of the 40 Smith & Wesson. Now let's take a few shots. There we go. All right, 40 Smith & Wesson, big fan. Let's move on. Here we have the SIG P220. I've had this one for a long time. It's a 45 ACP, has a single stack magazine. This is the carry model with a 3.8 inch barrel, aluminum frame, a rail, a sweet shooter all around. And they don't make the carry one anymore. They make the larger one with uh, the barrel length over four inches. But I've owned this for a long time. I've always enjoyed it. And it's, a, it's just a, a sweet shooter all around. Let's see how I do. Every time I fire this gun, I remember how much I appreciate the P220. Sticking with 45 ACP, we've got a SIG 1911 TAC pack that is a beautiful 1911. It has the same slide cuts as many of the other models, so we call that the, the same SIG DNA. It's got the five inch barrel, the flat, flat face trigger right there, a beveled out magwell, same 1911 magazine and an extended Extractor, just a beautiful looking and feeling handgun. This time, let's start left to right. All right, nice all around 1911 handgun. Here we have a discontinued SIG handgun. Many people love it, the P239. It's a single stack nine millimeter, has an eight round mag, this one has a 3.6 inch barrel, fiber optic front sight, uh, rubber grip. I had one many years ago, did not have the rubber grip. Does have the indented figure grooves in there. Single action, or shall I say double action, single action. Very nice firearm. Many people carried it back in the day, but that was before you had more options. Get a load of the look of that hammer. Very cool. Let's take a few shots. Yep, shoots just like the one I used to own 
Nice shooter, kind of a shame, but I also like the newer 6-hour models. All right, so now we're transitioning into polymer frame striker fire 6-hour handguns, and we're going to start with the P320X Compact. It's got a 3.6-inch barrel, a flat face trigger, beautiful handgun, 15-round magazine, X-ray 3 front uh, night sight dot, and then we have the Sig Light night sight rear optic ready. I had this for over a year, and I remember at that time this was the hottest gun going in the gun world, and I think Sig did a phenomenal job with it. Let's take a few shots. Let's start on the left. Very nice. One of my favorite SIGs is the P320 X5. Five inch barrel, right? That's where the X5 comes from. 21 round magazines. Flat face trigger, just like the X Compact. Fiber optic front sight. Serrated rear sights. Adjustable. Uh, optic ready. And you know, this thing is just such an awesome shooter. I, I really do enjoy it. Large mags. Does have slide cuts right there to lighten it up. I love the X5 models, and a lot of people compete with. Whoa. <laughs> a couple of them, you know, I think I hit all of them, but a couple of them jumped a very lightweight trigger, and I loved it. All right, so here we have another P320 X5. Same deal for the most part. It does have the flared out magwell. It has a tuned trigger, a recoil spring that's been changed out. It is meant to shoot uh, competition loads. My friend Jim owns this gun. He competes. He's an ace shooter. He really is amazing. We're going to get him out here to shoot this P320 X5, which is his competition handgun. Man, what a sweet combination of loads and the gun itself. Big fan of the X5. All right, many people were wondering, where's the P365? Well, here it is. And what's a beautiful thing with the modular design is that you can switch out the frames and that's what this is. It's an XL frame that offers three finger contact with a three inch barrel upper. Uh, excellent, small, lightweight, Handgun, it's got the 12 round magazine. I only have seven loaded up. It has X-Ray 3 front dot, Sig Light night sights like many of the other compact models. Uh, many people call this their carry gun and they love it. Let's start at the center. Yeah, excellent. Little lightweight CCW gun. All right, let's roll through these SIGs and take one more look at them. Here we have a SIG P229 and 40 Smith & Wesson. Over here, P226, double action, single action. Here we have a SIG 226 Legion, single action only. Here we have the P239 discontinued. That one's a single stack 9mm. Single stack 45 SIG P220. Over here, we've got a SIG 1911 TAC Pack. 45 ACP, a little more of a standard 1911 over here in 40 Smith & Wesson. Here we have the SIG P320 X Compact, SIG P320 X5, and another X5. We saw Jim shoot that. That was amazing. And then over here we've got the P365. What a nice group of SIG Sauer handguns, and I certainly did enjoy each and every one of them today at the range if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate the thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe